They got some kids, I tell you, Preston. Have you seen? They got a kick returner over there, number five, running back slash wide receiver slash kick returner. And this kid, man, I'm telling you, I think he's got a a, a, a return in each game this year, including the spring. Uh, man, he's done some good stuff. And they got a big-time cornerback. But um, if you get a chance, showcase that uh, that film on number five. And uh, he's right a now. heck of a player. He's uh, he's a heck of a player. Pull that up. And he, I tell you, keep an eye on that kid. Um, very good player. But, Blake uh, has been scrappy, man. They have been doing some good stuff since last season. They look really good this summer. How's their new quarterback I mean, doing at Blake? Xavier is uh, doing well. I mean, they're they they they're just doing some really impressive stuff on film. And uh, their defense gets after it. They've got one of the best young cornerbacks uh, in the area. Uh, number two, I don't, I don't even know names. I know numbers. Number two, uh, but then Alonzo, they got the quarterback and they got a running back over there that's doing some really good stuff on every game this year. Hard nosed runner. Uh, they got some kids at the wide receiver spot. It's just, it's, it's such a fun thing to evaluate the game film across the Bay Area. But that, I tell you what, I, I really enjoyed that Alonzo Blake game. And uh, yeah, go ahead and feature that running back. I mean, he, that he's doing some good that, stuff on film right there, huh? Leon, Leon Haynes is his name. Leon Haynes is a senior, 5'7, 165 over there at Blake. Yep. I tell you right now, that that type of kid right there, um, you know, wherever he ends up in college, whatever level, that kid right there is going to be a good uh, good player. Um, just he's going to have a big year. That, that kid's going to have – he'll have 10 to 15 touchdowns this year. He'll probably return four or five for, uh, you know, kicks. Um, back in the Javier Arenas day, you know, when, when that kid was returning every kickoff. Uh, I tell yep. you, this kid, number two, lined up on that kick, uh, the kick return. Ah, man, the, 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 the field position that they get is uh, – it's just it, – they're going to be a good team to watch this year, I tell you. But but he's a player, speaking man. Of, he's, yep. Speaking of field position, is there a better located stadium than Blake High School? Like right, right there on the river, river and stuff? Right there yep. on the river, man. Yep. You know, I know it's tight. It, yep. it, it's not great for players, but just the location is awesome, man. So I just – I get a High kick School out of uh, – many- how many how many times can you kick a, a field goal and have the the ball go into a parking garage? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I remember I remember back 20, 15, 20, 15 years ago, I would go film at Blake, and uh, they had a wide receiver over there, Tito Gonzalez, um, and he he ended up going to West Virginia, uh, but he was uh, he, he was one of their real great players, but just quietly went out there and got it done, and. It went to West Virginia, had a you know nice career, but uh, but yeah, I've always been a, a big fan of uh, of Blake and uh, just seeing some of the things they do on film. It's just it's good to see. 